Cybera is Alberta's partner in Canada's Research and Education Network. We are there to support the public sector in connecting our institutions, our schools, and research organizations to the world. It's a dedicated fiber pipeline that is just for research and innovation. So this means if you are at a university, you can connect to any university around the world and you are using that dedicated network to do that. It will always be our foundational reason for being, running Alberta's Research Education Network. It's where we came from. Our roots are in networking and it's core to everything that we do. And based on this foundation, we're able to tackle all the other things we wanna do on top of this network. We also provide a peering network service where members are able to connect to most popular internet sites like Google and Microsoft, unmetered and uncapped. And we are able to connect to other ones, like the Supernet is a big one. It connects to every single public building in the province. Um, because we connect to that and anyone who is also connected to that, they can get onto our network. We also provide the Internet Buying Group. The Internet Buying Group allows our members to have access to transit at a much lower cost than they would if they had to buy the transit on their own. Our members in the rural areas and outside of the major cities are still having to pay the high cost for their own transit connectivity and so the Internet Buying Group especially helps those members uh, gain access to the internet at a, at a lower rate. One of the, the things I'm most proud of is that Cyberans step up to the plate and help where we can. We are there participating on every committee. We are there trying to drive the National Research Education Network mission and vision forward for the greater good across Canada. It's not just us on our own. So it's really important that we work with our partners across the country. The bottom line is we're, we're trying to find ways to use our network to create a better internet experience for the final users, but also something that's less risky and less costly, let's say, for the administrators at the institutions. 